vehicle advertising and free and paid marketing. When it comes to promoting your website, you will want to do all kinds of marketing strategies. One such strategy that you can use to get traffic back to your website is vehicle advertising. I see a lot business owners in my city using this technique all the time. Some of the designs are good, and some of them are bad. Point two great examples of good vehicle advertising is from Best Buy's Geek Squad, and also on the SUVs of radio stations. If you can find a way to make your video ad as effective as these, you will find yourself getting lots of new offline leads to your website. And if you didn't already know, offline leads and customers are very valuable. They purchase a lot more things than online leads and customers do. Nevertheless, internet marketing is still a great way to make money on the internet. Typically, it doesn't matter what kind of site that you run. Marketing is marketing, and no matter the website, you can drive a lot of traffic to it via free marketing or paid advertising. I personally like free marketing better though, why do I prefer free marketing? Well, there's nothing wrong with getting 100% commissions from the free marketing route. This is something that really catches my eye. But on the flip side of things, when it comes to paid advertising, you don't know what your average commission will be. Sometimes you may get sales, then sometimes you might get a sale after 400 hits to your website, and then sometimes you don't make money at all. Things like this really doesn't get my attention. If you're going to use free marketing, you should know that there is a lot of work that needs to be done. You have to market all the time, you can't give up, the traffic will come a little slower than paid advertising, and you may not see good results until you've been marketing your site for a long time. So this is something to think about, when it comes to paid advertising, you should know that you can get instant results. The only problem with paid advertising is that once you stop advertising, your traffic stops coming to your website. So if you're going to use paid advertising, it's best to generate a lead so that a portion of your website visitors will repeatedly visit your website, even after all of your funds have been depleted. So, in a sense, you're still earning money and getting website hits even after your advertising funds have stopped. You will want to test and see if paid advertising is right for you or if you can only survive off of free marketing alone, these concepts of marketing regarding free and paid advertising are things that you will want to ponder about in your internet business. The more you do more free marketing in your business, the more you will be able to earn 100% profits on every sale that you make. Plus, you can put them in your back-end marketing funnel and earn additional sales from them later on down the road. Take these tips and use them to market your business effectively online. Good luck with your internet marketing efforts.